back at my spot, my favorite spot, Kate's Hole. And I'm, I'm gonna try out this, uh, it's called Big Eye's Lure. Big Eye. Big Eye. That's one of Steve's lures. It's like a, it's it's not quite a top water. It's like a subsurface, just, just subsurface. It's got a rattle on it. Uh, I think it's gonna be a good lure. Let's try it out. The water is finally, uh, it's finally starting to come up. Nope, I didn't get stuck. I didn't actually go over there in the area this time. I had to, I had to paddle a little bit, but water is, 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 was just deep enough for me to get out here and be all right. So hopefully this uh, Steve can do it again. Supposedly work it just like a topwater. It's it's got a little motion, just straight retrieve, but it actually has a topwater motion just under the surface. Let's see. I actually have a corky I've been wanting to broken back that I've been wanting to try here. Let's see. Got this real pretty one just recently. Let's try that one. I don't know. I, I like. Uh, I'm partial to the pearl kind of colors I just you know they talk about your confidence bait uh, confidence color is it's like a pearl that one's kind of cool looking let's try it out Got him. There he is. Uh, did he get off? Nope, still there. Man, I tell you what, that just, that's it. It's broken backs. Uh, it's not, it's like probably a, a little dink, obviously. But, let's see what we get here. First one. That's a little baby. Let's see. Oh, uh, yeah, it's not it's not terrible. About 14 inches. Surprisingly enough, a little thin. All right, calm down. All right. Might actually see if we can get a nice one today. So from what I can tell, these broken backs, they, uh, whoa, there it is. It's about another, might be a little bigger, probably about the same size. Not about the same size. <laughs> it's like a twin.
No, nah, this is smaller. Little baby, look at him. I forget what Steve, Mr. T. Brown calls it. It's cool though. Let's see what we can do. Oh, so I was saying the uh, these broken backs seem to to uh, sink a little bit slower than a regular fat boy but they got they got that big profile and all that tail moving it's got a nice wobble don't get out of whack here So I was following one of my groups on my uh, Facebook, <laughs> and uh, guy was asking. Well, he was saying that. Uh, oh, there it is. That's a bigger one. All right. Not a bad thing not to be able to finish your flock sometimes. That one actually might be legal. I guess that's not a bad thing. Being interrupted by some nice pickle trap. Oh. Whoa! Damn. I like that. You like that new bluer, Steve? Oh, there it is. I think... Uh, I thought the other one was bigger too, so let's see. Oh. They're fighting better. So I don't know if you could tell, I use quick clips and I actually use this one and it would have, honestly would have been the last the last one I would have thought that I, that works for me. But I hope to do a video about that. I have I have so many different kinds that I've tried out and none of them just I just didn't like any of them. But this one they work, man. I mean I could actually use them. I, my uh i don't really have big hands but my you know it's cold sometimes and i'm getting older and doing these loop knots all the time i just get tired of waiting i just want to just want to get it done Let's see here that oh, turned out to be a good day
anyways I was saying <laughs> uh, the guy was talking about you know he doesn't feel he was talking about fish finder he said oh, I don't know about fish finder it's kind of like cheating well I have a little I think it's a striker for it's a little one that as far as fish finding fish it's not what I use it for I don't know about you guys I mean well you know I'm sure the if you see a fish on there yeah I get all, I get all worked up I'm like oh crap there's a bunch of fish on there but I mainly use it for for the GPS and for the um, and for the depth finding you know to get, be able to find a you know I talk about structure but to be able to find these holes you know these little these areas and that's one of the things I like about this area there's actually two good sized holes over here there's one that runs across here that's about five six feet deep and then there's another one there's the there's the causeway there but there's another one that's probably about 100 yards away that's another another uh, deep spot Oops, there it is. Oh, almost lost it. Oh, that one might, might make, huh? Dang it caught my scupper my scupper hole here yeah, um, movement in the forest over here there's like something swimming around Let's see if I can pick it up it looks big oh there it is oh yeah red. Nope, it's a nice trout. Alright, I knew I saw something. There's more. Let's see if I can... picture huh That's legal. <laughs> Let's see. Quick. Looks like about 16 and a 16. All right. All right. So let me ask you guys. You see these uh. You see these guys throwing back the fish, right? And you know. Uh, you know, I, I I appreciate the conservative thing, and I don't uh, all the fish I do keep. 
I eat. I share with my family. Uh, sometimes I go out with my friends and I let them keep it because I know they're going to eat it. And I've kind of always said these guys that you see, oh, there it is. Oh, there's a good one. Uh, that's another nice trout. Ooh, come on, stay with me. Good 17, a little bigger, a little bigger new one. Getting bigger, guys, getting bigger. You know, I just got this lure too. I got it Wednesday. Well, a couple days ago. So that's a uh, Just just under 18 inches. Good, that's nice. See, there's something over here. Let's see if I can rotate it here. Thumps. There's nibble nibbles. There it is. I don't even think this one. Oh crap! Oh maybe this. All right. That's an 18. All right. 